Well, welcome back everyone. Today was a very nice day outside here in Des Moines and most of the state. We did see temperatures finally reach above average across the state. We got to 69 degrees here in Des Moines, 60 up in Ames. Welcome back everyone. Well, today felt like a wintry day outside. It said of an April day outside. We saw about six inches of snow hit Rock Valley today and, and 4.1 inches as well hit Algona. Down in Cherokee, you got light amounts of snow, 1.5 inches of snow you got, you received today, actually. So, well, welcome back everyone. Today was once again a great day outside. Uh, highs around the state, we got to 66 degrees here in Des Moines. Uh, that's our average high temperature for this time of year, 64 up in Ames. And towards Mesa City, you got to near 60 degrees for a high. Now starting tomorrow, we do have Drake Relays beginning here in Des Moines. We're looking at 69 degrees for a high temperature tomorrow. A little better on Friday, however, it'll be a little windier on Friday with 72 degrees for the Drake Relays. And Saturday will be a little cooler, however, but still mostly sunny skies outside and 65 degrees for your races on Saturday. Tomorrow here across the state, highs will be anywhere from 61 degrees up in Mesa City to 69 in Ames. Down in Lamona, you're expecting about 68 degrees for your high. Friday will be pretty much like Thursday. Mesa City, 62 degrees, 69 in Ames. Over in Spencer, a nice 64 degrees expected for Friday's high temperature. Now Saturday will be a little cooler than the next two days, but we still we still feel a lot like spring outside. 60 for a high, expecting the names over in eastern Iowa. Cedar Rapids, you're looking at 58 degrees. So a very cool and calm for this type of year. Temperatures for Saturday. Our sky, sky cam live shows the great sunny skies outside here in Des Moines right now. And right now in Des Moines, we're still at 66 degrees under a mostly sunny sky. Some patchy clouds out there and a slight northwest at wind at about 6 miles per hour. Right now across the state for temperatures, we're anywhere from 58 degrees in Mesa City to about 66 degrees in Des Moines as of right now. Clouds and radar shows that we were glimpsed in southwestern Iowa with some slight, very slight showers. But the main story is Missouri is seeing a lot of light rain right now. Now our next system that could be impacting us is up towards the Canadian border and Montana. Those will be bringing us clouds possibly through tomorrow. And it's also explaining we need the rain if we get any from this next cold front. Down in southwestern the United States, they are experiencing a stream or exceptional drought towards New Mexico and Kansas. And it's impacting some areas here in Iowa. Down in southeastern Iowa and towards Ottumwa, you are in a moderate or even severe drought as of right now. We need rain desperately. However, in my future track, you can see that we do not really have a good chance some pesky clouds move into the area in the northeastern Iowa, anywhere from Waterloo to Decorah. Well, we're looking at clear skies for mainly tomorrow. Some patchy clouds move in tomorrow evening, but no rain with this system. And Friday, it looks like another dry day to end your work week. Here in Des Moines, 44 degrees for a expected low tonight under a nice and clear, quiet night under light winds outside. Tomorrow in Des Moines, 70 degrees. Once again, a great day outside. A little more windy than today. Southwest and northwest winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. And for our extended forecast, it's like nothing to complain about. We have 72 degrees on Friday. Saturday, we cool down to the mid 60s before we warm up and possibly hit 81 degrees on Monday. And Tuesday and Wednesday is our next good chance of rain before we cool down toward the end of next week and then rebound back to 70 and 75 degrees by next weekend. In Iowa, average about 48 tornadoes a year. Last year alone, we had 55 here in the state. About 87% of our tornadoes we see here in the state are either EF0 or EF1, and only one-tenth of one percentage of the tornadoes we see here in Iowa are rated as an EF5. And always, if we do have a threat of a tornado, or if, if there's a tornado warning out, I should say, you always need to find the lowest floor of your home and be sure you're away from any windows or any doors. We do have our first severe threat of the year moving in on Friday. Friday, we have a nice chance of tornadoes, hail, and wind, and the SBC has issued a marginal risk for severe weather across the more, most of the state for, Saturday, for Friday night into Saturday morning, mainly between 3 and 9 o'clock Friday night, however, it could happen later. We'll just have to keep you tuned in as you tune in to Local 5 tomorrow. As we talk about this Friday system, we have a low pressure system situated on the Nebraska-Iowa border as we wake up on Friday. As we advance through time on Friday, that low pressure system moves to the northwest of Des Moines, bringing a very good chance of some storms into Friday evening. 
And Friday, Friday evening and Saturday morning, it looks like it's just going to be wet outside. As we head on through Saturday, just more rain. And behind this, unfortunately, we're talking about the middle of April, and we're still seeing snow move back into the, at least half the state into the Sunday morning. Snow is still falling outside, but it's very light in nature across the metro. This will be our last band of it, and it'll be moving out of the area in the next couple hours. Now up in northeastern Iowa, you do see the net heavier band of snow as you head towards the core in that area, closer to the Minnesota border and Wisconsin border. Now as we expand out even more, Wisconsin, you're still covered in snow, very light snow, and then there's a heavy band, like I said, expanding from very northeastern Iowa into the central Wisconsin, and that all this system will be moving out of the area in the next few hours. We did a good job, though. The, the, the weekend has the best weather, and then Monday just all goes to, to heck. <laughs> well, it's it's kind of nice to have the nice weather as it we're is. heading into the March. You yeah. know, you got to feel like spring outside sometime. Yeah, but I don't know. You <laughs> got to you got to just you live in Iowa. You just got to deal with it. That's I guess. Right.